NordVPN Guide, Disable IPv6 on Windows, Mac, Android and Linux Part 1, here you can find information on IPv6, and possible IP address leakage associated with it. 1. What is IPv6? IPv6 is the sixth revision to the Internet Protocol and the successor to IPv4. It functions similarly to IPv4 in that it provides the unique, numerical IP addresses necessary for Internet-enabled devices to communicate. It allows for a much larger number of unique IP addresses, and thus solves the issue of IPv4 address depletion in the world. The depletion of IPv4 addresses was predicted years ago, so the switch has been in progress for the last decade. However, progress has been slow only a small fraction of the web has switched over to the new protocol. In addition, IPv4 and IPv6 essentially run as parallel networks exchanging data between these protocols requires special gateways. To make the switch, software and routers will have to be changed to support the more advanced network. This will take time and money. The first real test of the IPv6 network was done on June 8, 2011, World IPv6 Day. Google, Facebook and other prominent web companies test drive the IPv6 network to see what it can handle and what still needs to be done to get the world switched over to the new network. Following the success of the 2011 test day, the Internet Society carried out a World IPv6 launch day on June 6, 2012 which, instead of just a test day, was planned to permanently enable IPv6 for the products and services of the participants. 2. Is my IPv6 address leaking? You can test if you are using IPv6 addresses on this website, http colon slash slash ipv6-test.com. If you are properly connected to NordVPN, it should say that IPv6 is not supported on your system, part 2. Why is there a potential IPv6 leak and how can I prevent it? Depending on your device and slash or network, you can simply disable the usage of IPv6 altogether, in 99.9% .9 cases it will have no additional effect on your internet usage. As noted in the section above, IPv6 adoption process is slow, and almost all services allow access through IPv4. Disable IPv6 in your home network, you can disable IPv6 in your network completely by changing your router configuration. Each router is different, but most have the ability to turn IPv6 completely off, in that case, you won't have to change anything in your devices. For information how to disable it on your router, consult your user manual or network administrator. If you are not able to disable it on the network, for example, when using public networks, you can disable it on your device instead. Disable IPv6 on Windows The latest NordVPN application does not leak IPv6 addresses. However, if you are using an older version, or connecting manually, you can disable IPv6 by following the steps below. 1. Open Network and Sharing Center Fastest way would be to right-click the network icon in the notification tray. 2. Click on the connection you are using, right next to Connections. 3. Click on Properties. 4. Uncheck Internet Protocol version 6, TCP slash IPv6, in the list, and click OK, then close. Disable IPv6 on Mac OS X Our latest NordVPN application does not leak IPv6 addresses. However, if using an older version, or connecting manually, you can disable IPv6 by following the below content, 1 Open Finder 2. Click on Applications 3. Click on Utilities Folder 4. Double click on Terminal.app 5. Run the following command in the terminal window. Network setup list all network services this will list all of your network interfaces and their names. 6. Identify the network interface you are using, most commonly Ethernet or Wi-Fi. Use the following command in the terminal window to disable IPv6 on that interface. Please note that you may have to use quote marks to envelope the interface name. A few examples, network setup set 6 off Ethernet network setup set 6 off Wi-Fi you will be prompted to enter your OS X administrator password. Afterwards, IPv6 will be disabled. While usually not necessary, if you wish to re-enable IPv6 on your device, you can simply run this command in the terminal, Network Setup Set 6 Automatic Wi-Fi Network Setup Set 6 Automatic Ethernet Disable IPv6 on Android NordVPN app for Android automatically prevents IPv6 leaks, starting from version 1.8.1. If you using the latest version of NordVPN Android app, you can disable IPv6 in two ways, 1. Root your device, and disable IPv6 on your Android device, 2. Disable IPv6 in your whole network or use a network that does not use IPv6. Disable IPv6 on iOS NordVPN does not leak IPv6 addresses on iOS. Disable IPv6 on Chrome OS, Chrome eBook, unfortunately, disabling IPv6 is not possible on Chrome OS. If you are experiencing IPv6 leaks, please consider disabling IPv6 in your network, instructions above, or using a network which does not use IPv6 addresses. Disable IPv6 on Linux i. Red Hat based distributions here's how to disable the protocol on a Red Hat based system. Open a terminal window. Change to the root user. Issue the below commands one by one, 
SYSCTLWnet.ipv6.conf all dot disable underscore IPv6 equals 1 SYSCTLWnet.ipv6.conf default dot disable underscore IPv6 equals 1 SYSCTLWnet.ipv6.conf ton 0 dot disable underscore IPv6 equals 1 To re-enable IPv6, issue the following commands SYSCTLWnet.ipv6.conf all dot disable underscore IPv6 equals 0 SYSCTLWnet.ipv6.conf default dot disable underscore IPv6 equals 0 SYSCTLWnet.ipv6.conf ton 0 dot disable underscore IPv6 equals 0 2. Debian based distributions here's how to disable the protocol on a Debian based machine 1. Open a terminal window 2. Issue the command sudo nano slash etc slash sysctl.conf. 3. Add the following at the bottom of the file, net.ipv6.conf all dot disable underscore ipv6 equals 1 net.ipv6.conf default dot disable underscore ipv6 equals 1 net.ipv6.conf low dot disable underscore ipv6 equals 1 net.ipv6.conf ton 0 dot disable underscore ipv6 equals 1 4. Save and close the file. 5. Reboot the machine. To re-enable IPv6, remove the above lines from slash etc slash sysctl.conf and reboot the machine.